Hey guys, and welcome back to more Warhammer Vermintide. Here we're going to be doing the Smuggler's Run. In the last episode, I got this awesome shotgun. So, give me a lot more damage. I don't have the accuracy I did with the crossbow, but it's still quite accurate, quite speedy, and a lot of damage. So, does not penetrate armor, but we're going to give it a shot. I also upgraded it with regrowth, so when I do damage, there's a chance I'll gain health. So, potentially really so good. Because you know this, I'm at the forge. Can you explain the upgrade system for me? I can actually. Oop. So I have second. to probably what apply so the one forge, of my lower level. So the forge, if you look at the forge system, there's three ways and it's very intuitive. So fuse, you fuse five items at the same rarity to get a better item. So if you fuse mm -hmm. five items in Um we can ask other oh, socks to show it here. So I'm gonna put five items in. Oops, actually, no, I don't want to use my crossbow. Never mind, I won't show you. But you put five items in, and then you get a resulting green item. The green item you get is based on the items you put in. So if I put in, say, um, th say I put in three great axes. Well, I'll just show, for example, I put in a crossbow, um, two great axes, and a shield and a hammer. I have a 2 inch 5% chance to get an axe. They're actually all different, but if they're, your result is based on how many you put in. So if you wanted to get a better axe, you'd put in all axes, and you'd get a green axe if all the axes were green. If you put in 5 blue axes, you'd get a blue axe. So every time, you upgrade by 1. So 5 lower equals 1 higher. The upgrade right. is then better items have higher level slots. So you use the, I don't know what they're called, but we'll call them plentiful, common, and rare ores. You unlock those abilities by using the ores. To get the ores, you just salvage an item of that quality. So if you put a blue item in there, you'll probably get a blue rare. I haven't fiddled with it, but that's my understanding of how the system works. A green item, you'll get a green um, thing. I've also heard yeah, that you can get between one and four. So Interesting. But yeah, we're still waiting for a player. People keep like look like they're coming in and then not. Yeah, it's very odd. We've got, we've got the circle up there. <laughs> Come on, join, join. You know you want to. So I'm sure it's just a common. I know it tries to match make people closest to you first, so because it has less latency, and then it keeps going further and further away from you. So it will maybe do like, I don't know, like I don't know how it works, but I know they try to match make people who are closest to you first. And that's why I guess matchmaking can seem longer sometimes. That's fine. I'd rather have people with a better connection. And that's the, that's the thinking. They've agreed to bring supplies in through the sewers on the condition that I provide a way in. Yeah, there's more scaven above ground than below at this point. Get down there. All right. Let's do this. So my understanding is we're just trying to clear a path through to the smuggler's den. Is that the same idea you get? That's pretty much. And I'm going to record. Hello and welcome to the Raiding Gaming Network. My name is Matt and we, aka me and the Green Ling here, are working on Smuggler's Run here in Warhammer the End Times Vermintide. Um, trying to clear a path for some smugglers. Yes. Last episode, I missed the intro because uh, I messed up, but I actually got it this time. <laughs> yeah, his Imperior P Raid PC game is totally way worse than my, like, two-year-old, <laughs> like, so I'm, I'm with Raft Gaming PC. I'm performance now that I'm down to uh, 720, but I, I cannot I'm, get 1080. Oh, I just found it funny because I have, like, my old, old like, two... Like, couple year old gaming PC compared to your like ra raid, like, intent. Like, mine's, mine's just. Make no mistake, my computer is a monster. But it's just. I, I think I'm actually processor limited in this game. Oh, yeah. Lots of bombs we're finding. That's gonna be useful. Ooh, can we blow that? Oh. What the hell, door? Stay open. Man, no one's even took a damage yet, and they already gave us a healing item. They gave us- that's our third healing item. 
Oh, I took a little bit of damage there. They've been rather generous this this run. Anyway, guys, your goal is generally to take as least damage as possible. It's even good practice for the higher difficulties where enemies are going to do a lot more damage. Yes. Okay, you guys kind of left me behind, but I did manage to catch up. <laughs> yeah, that well, shotgun. The shotgun that you got in action. Yeah, oh. I just used it right there. Explosions. Explosions not happening. Oh, okay. Yeah, shotgun is pretty sweet. That didn't blow up the wall or anything? That makes me sad. What? Uh, there was... God, there's a ton of them here. Um, there was explosions, like, stacked next to that gate. And I thought it was going to, uh, blow open the gate, but it didn't do anything. Oh, okay. Is that all of them dead? Okay. It was right here, but then nothing happened. Hmm. Did someone throw a bomb? No, there was like powder cakes. Oh, okay. Uh, gutter runner. Where is he? Okay. <laughs> we both hit him with our ranged weapons. Overpowered, man. Medical supplies, anybody needs it? No. I don't think anybody really needs it. Where are they? You should, if you see them, you should press T on them. Just so everybody knows where they are. Yeah. It's, uh, it's actually C for me. I rebound it, so it's oh, on right. my mouse now. But, yes. But it's a good thing to do, just so everybody knows if anybody wanted them. That's what I've been doing for everything I see. And then you don't even have to call them out, you can just... Oop, oh, had a little start I there. I agree. Wholeheartedly, but... Man, you guys are just killing everything. I'm... I feel kind of useless. I'm not gonna lie. Up. I feel like I usually am cutting down way more. I was actually focused on healing someone, so... <laughs> I, I love doing stuff like that, healing the most, like, the person with the least health, rather than, like, letting someone else just grab it and heal themselves. Also, I cut a rat's tail off. You did? You yeah. Did Apparently. I, I cut his tail off and he died. Are they, like, um... Like, Samson, if you cut off their, their tail, they, uh... Or like uh, Saiyans? Yeah, like Saiyans. It's not like Samson. Samson was, was his hair, well, I think. Cut off his hair, but yeah. you know. But Saiyans are a better analogy. Saiyans are a much better uh, <laughs> analogy there. Then again, I guess they proved that's not technically true, right? How'd they prove that? Did they go back in time? No, I mean... Technically, once they've removed their tails, that's when they all... Oh, I thought you talk, I thought you were talking about Samson again. No, no, no. I'm like, how did they prove that Samson wasn't true? Like, to oh, go back in time? <laughs> yeah, Marty and, uh, Marty and Doc. Well, Marty was supposed to show up this year, but I never saw him. Uh, we had, you know, we had dinner. It was fine. Oh, okay. Yeah, no, he was nice. Oh, okay. Well, I guess it can't be two places at one time. Exactly. No, it was cool. Man, the archer's just picking off enemies. It's so good. I know you, the archer. That's what. <laughs> <laughs> Ammo and medical supplies. Did you hear a, ro a roar? Nah, uh, well, maybe. I don't know what it actually was, to be fair. Oh, okay. I heard a sound. I heard a sound too. Okay. Guess I'll grab one of those there. Can I not shoot through this? Oh, oh. that's a gate. Can't shoot through gates. But you can shoot through the bars, I'm sure. Yeah. Can you? You can, can't you? Yeah. But I couldn't shoot through gates. Oh, a total waste of a bomb. Oh, never mind. It killed Pack Raptor, so it was not a yeah, waste. Yeah, no, that was, that was a good bomb. If it wouldn't have killed a Pack Raptor, though, I would have said it was a waste. I agree. I agree. But maybe he just like, knows there's a special there, so. Uh, if he does, he's played this a lot. Again, I guess he's probably level he's, 37. He's so level he 37, so I'm guessing he probably has played this a lot. <laughs> That'll be fun. They're smart enough to run away from the explosive barrel. Interesting. Uh, it didn't help all of them. So am I alone again? Oh no, Hernandez is here with me. So. Uh, no, I'm alone. You but shouldn't be all... alone. You could get cornered by gutter uh, routers, or a pack rat or something. Well... I'm not that far alone. I'm just on the other side of the wall from you guys. Plus, I mean, I have my sword with me. That's that's how it works in uh, 
in Zelda. Oh, right? you can't you can't track two things at a time. It's not bug bugs, I'll tell you that. Uh, might as well. Do you should this. heal up. Yep. You can there jump through here as well. <laughs> Let's do it. I'm trying to see if there's like Hello. a pack rat or something down there. I don't see anything. Cause that would be that'd be a real dirty move to put it like right under the stairs. So if you jumped off, it would just <laughs> grab you. Uh, I mean, that would be our luck. That's that'd be about how it goes for us. Ooh, this is a lot of rats. Okay. Uh, got a run. Got a runner. Got a runner. Oh, he ninja out. I got a shock. No, I... <laughs> well, I don't you know. Got one shot on? I got a shotgun blast into him. So. Oh, he's up there. Oh, he got me. I hit him. Yeah. So. Is he still up there? I thought he was. That's the one thing good. If you actually manage to um, call him out, it will show you where he respawns if he respawns within a couple seconds. He's over here now. He's a real jerk. I was trying to call him out, but don't think I quite got him. Oh no, I did get him. Who's he on? Is he on you again? No. I sidestepped him against somebody else. Oh, okay. Gonna pull up I my did, shotgun uh, for when he shows up I did again. Tag him, though. I do He's like here. that you can actually dodge them, unlike the hunters in Left 4 Dead. Yeah, exactly. He's still not dead? No, nope. now he is. Now he is. There's a whore. Where's Zalian? Yeah. Okay. I just had to heal Zelly and he was like nearly dead. Oh boy, there's a lot coming. From behind us? Yeah. Heads up. Haha! <laughs> World's greatest incendiary bomb. Yeah, it was pretty effective. <laughs> got an achievement for it. Oh, what'd you get? Oh, is that the achievement? Uh, World's greatest incendiary bomb? I got an achievement, bomb? um, five rats, like, one shot. Oh, okay. I guess I killed five things with... Yeah, with that. one item. I feel like you're probably supposed to do it with, like, a big sweeping attack. I think this is the end, so let's just move on out. Yeah, possibly. Yeah, so that's Boys. a pretty easy mission. I, I mean, like I said, the Magnus one is the longest one I know of. Oh, okay. Where's the... Where's the van? It's a coach. We don't have vans yet. Everybody here? Yeah. Nice. I am victorious. I said, don't think that was something good. So, yeah, that one yeah. we could do definitely do on a harder difficulty. I think so. Yeah, the short ones aren't as bad. So yeah, oh, come on, give without me good. without bonus die, I only got two. I got four. You got four with no bonus die. That's pretty good. Yeah. I got another green elf sword, too, it looks like. Oh, sweet. Ooh. Oh, that looks sick. I'm going to use it. Yeah. That was awesome. Return to the end. So anyway, guys, I think we'll call this an episode here. Thanks for coming out for more Vermintime. We'll be back in the next episode for more. Thanks, guys. Later.